her. I don't even care to say her name. And she says in a video that she has murder on her mind as she twerks in front of Planned Parenthood. Take a listen. Let's just stop it there. On the way to plant, on, on the way to the clinic, I got I got murder on my mind. Do, I mean, do you, I? Do you have words? I don't have. La bravoure prend des risques. Elle défie le statu quo et dit tout haut que le moment du changement est arrivé. Depuis plus de cinq décennies, Planned Parenthood Global soutient les courageux en s'associant à des organisations du monde entier pour faire progresser la santé sexuelle et reproductive. De la formation de sages-femmes au Guatemala à la refonte de la santé sexuelle en Afrique de l'Ouest, nos partenaires adoptent l'innovation avec des jeunes courageux à leur tête. Au Burkina Faso, des milliers de personnes... Someone asked us, how can I tell when my partner has an orgasm? There is no one way to have an orgasm. Lots of people think there are sure signs that you'll always know when someone has an orgasm, a.k.a. comes. But the truth is... Asked us, on what day of my period can I start taking the pill? You can start taking the pill on any day you like, at any time during your menstrual cycle. But... Look, you are here for a reason. What that is, is for you to decide. You know what you got planned. You know what you're capable of. You know what you've already overcome. You are just as deserving of love and compassion as everyone else. So if the world hasn't told you this, I will. I see you. I see who you are. I see who you can become. I'm here for you, okay? Call me back. All right. Hey, first and foremost, I've got who I got with me. Arrows of Indignation, 144. Arrows of Indignation, 144, beloved brother, you know, from uh, from North Carolina. Okay, now, everybody, uh, you know, whom this may concern, who's watching this, you saw the clips that uh, uh, that me and the brother put in there before, and we're going to go into it. But first and foremost, giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rekakwadash. Yep. Double honors to the uh, apostles and elders of Great Millstone, of whom I learn from daily. And a That's healthy right. shalom to the brothers that are out there doing the work in truth and sincerity, just like this brother right here. Okay? So, you know, hey, without any further ado, you got anything to say about those clips? Hey, man. Eve and the serpent. Uh, holy matrimony made in hell, man. That's right. <laughs> That's right. A holy matrimony made in hell. But you know, it was all preordained by Yahabashim Yahusha, written of in Genesis. That's right, brother. You know, hey, like the brother said, man, uh they gonna they gonna hand are gonna join in hand until they both fall into a ditch. And that's gonna be that pit of burning fire. That's right. You see? Planned Parenthood. And she uh and she took it hook, line, and sinker and loves it. Loves it, huh? All right, now I got something to say about it before I get into uh, this first scripture I got right here. Okay. It's, you know, is that uh, uh, the uh, our people are laden. They are laden with sin, man. Laden mm -hmm. with sin, and she and, and and they love it. They love to have it so, okay. And the fact that, and the fact that uh, Esau eat them. Now, if you notice in those commercials, these are Planned Parenthood commercials. If you noticed in those commercials, who was it? 
It was so-called blacks, so-called <laughs> Latinos, and Native Americans, man. A, yes, sir. A, a native, native, a native Indians, if you will. Okay, which is the northern and the southern kingdom, the Israelites. All right, and then you had a uh, 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 LGB three CPO. You had a whole nigga. That was somebody uncle. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you see that? Yeah. Nigga, yeah, yeah. nigga name went from Lorenzo to Dog on Leslie. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 he, uh, <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh man. Hey, what he said used to be the Don Juan. Now your name is just Twan. Okay. Right. Right. Go. You see that? Yeah. Ghost. Okay. Chariot cam just popped up. All right. So let's get this first scripture right here. I'm gonna go ahead and jump right on into. We're gonna go. You know, hey, we're just gonna roll with it through, uh, uh you know, through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shimei All right. That's right. Isaiah one and verse three is one of my favorite scriptures. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib, but Israel doth not know. My people doth not consider. Verse four, a sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seed of evildoers, children that are corruptors. They have forsaken the Lord, Yahweh. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger. They are all gone away backwards. You see that? Provoked him to anger, man. And, you know, and, and right. yeah, and all his wrath and his fury is coming upon this earth. You see? All right. Verse five. Why should ye be stricken anymore? Ye will revolt more and more. The whole head is sick. The whole heart is faint. You see? Okay. You know, that's the first scripture I had. Hey, you can jump on in whenever you whenever you want to, Wop. Okay. Okay. All right. I got uh Matthew uh twelve and verse thirty four. That's one, two, three, four. <laughs> All right. This is red letters, Yahweh Shai speaking. Cause these people are uh, this this is uh the seed of evildoers, man, these people are sick. You know, didn't the scripture say, Thou shalt not murder? Mm hmm And that's murder right there. Even Esau's own science showed there's a spark of life when that sperm hits the egg, man. That's right. You know, how about Shim Yahusha sanctioned that life? He also sanctioned that that life, you know, was going to be terminated, but it's, it's, st it's still murder. That's right. You know, Matthew 12, verse uh, uh, 34, red letters, Yahusha speaking. Oh, generation of vipers, how can ye be uh, being evil speak good things? For out of the uh, out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaketh, man. What you say? I got murder on my mind on the way to the clinic. Hey, man. Mm -hmm. Straight disgusting, brother. Yeah, con. Straight disgusting, man. You know, uh, one thing about Eve, man. Eve is, uh, in uh, some cases, man, Eve then got more doggone uh, monstrous than Jake, man. That's right. That's right. The scripture even says even the sea monster draw out the breast. That's right. You know? That's right. You know? All right. So, hey, let's move on. Isaiah 30 and verse 12. I got, I got, hey, let's go. Let's I go. Keep going, brother. Okay. Wherefore, thus saith the Holy One of Israel, Yahweh Bahashim Yahashai, because ye despise this word. See, that's what it is. They have no fear of Yahweh Bahashim Yahashai. No fear. Okay, mm -hmm. they've been taught by the precepts of men. They they took uh, uh took and drunk all that damn wine. You know, they took and they drunk all that wine. They drunk that cup. All right, because ye despise the word and trust in oppression, and uh, uh and perverseness. You see that perverse. That's right, brother. And stay there on. See and stay there on. Thus, uh, verse thirteen. Therefore, this iniquity shall be to you. As a breach ready to fall, swelling out in a high wall, whose breaking cometh suddenly at an instant. You see? At an instant, man. You know, she that is my enemy, she's going to see it. Ain't no thing about it, bro. Eve is so delusional, man. Eve truly think everything is okay out here, man. Right. Right. That's the scary part, man. Hey, That's the scary part. Hey, Salakia, one one moment, one moment. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can do this. Let me see if I can do this right quick. 
Hey, uh, okay. go go ahead and get uh, get uh, get something else if you if you'd like. Okay, I got you, brother. But a brother, uh, a brother just called. <laughs> a brother just called in. I'm gonna see if I can add this call. Okay. Uh oh. Hello, you have reached. Uh, okay, well that didn't. Uh, work. All right, okay, go go ahead. That didn't work. Okay, okay. This is Jeremiah, chapter uh, ten, verse one and two. Man, hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Mm -hmm. Thus said the Lord, Learn not the way of the heathen. Right. I'm gonna stop it right there, man. All our people, but especially. Eve, man, Eve loved the way of the heathen, especially Esau, man. She loves it. She embellishes it. And he, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, hmm. for the heathen are dismayed at them. Right. You see what I'm saying? That's right, Doc. Yep. You know, Eve into astrology, Eve into witchcraft. You know, Eve loved all the ways of the heathen, man. But, but you know why? Because two-thirds of our people, man, you know, are envious of Esau's success. Right. They're envious of Esau's success. They cannot see Esau going down. And this is really, to be blunt, the, the majority of the nations are envious of Esau's success. Right. To a certain degree. You know, but especially our people, man, two thirds of our people, that is. This is Psalms 73. Hey, hey, it's like, hey, the scripture said, I was envious at the prosperity of the wicked. Hey, brother, that's what I'm going to. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to cut you off. Go ahead, huh? Now, you good. For I was envious at the foolish <laughs> when I saw the prosperity of the wicked. For there are no bands in their depth, but their strength is firm. They are not in trouble as other men. See, mm. this is what our people seeing. Well, damn, they getting away with all this shit. Yep. We might well join them. Right. I might well sell out. Neither are there plagues like other men. Therefore, pride compasses them about as a chain violence. And cover, and cover them as a garment. Their eyes stand out with fatness. They have more than, than the heart wish. could wish. That's right, brother. That's right. They are corrupt and speak wickedly concerning oppression. They do what? Yeah, man. Yeah. They are corrupt and speak wickedly concerning oppression. They speak lofty. They set their mouth against the heavens and their tongue walking through the earth. And see, Eve and the rest of the two-thirds, man, they have joined up with this devil, man. You know? Because they're envious of this devil doggone success, man. You know, they're envious of, of you know, Esau prospering, man. Wow. You know? And that's why people join hand-in-hand -hand with this devil, man. That's crazy, man. That's crazy, because... <laughs> You saying that right now? I just pulled up a uh, uh, CIA agent Gloria Steinem and that and that wicked ass Eve. Mm -hmm. It's right here. On, you you'll see it. You know you see it when you see it. Oh yeah, for sure. Wicked as hell, man. Okay. Yeah. yeah and that's the spirit right there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So lucky if I cut you off again, man. I didn't quit doing no, that. No, you good, brother. You know, you good. Go ahead, brother. All right. Hey, Deuteronomy twenty-eight verse fifty-six. The tender and delicate woman among you. You know, which is which is a a new thing. Now they want to talk about being what's it called a soft woman, right? Trying right, to be soft right. and all that, right? And and, and you know, and they are uh, envious at the prosperity of the wicked. You mm -hmm. know, because because uh, what they've done is they've gotten exactly what they wanted all the way from Genesis, like the book says, like the Bible right. says. They gotten mm -hmm. everything they wanted. Uh, 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 their eyes were open, and uh, and they, they you know they saw their nakedness. And really, what uh, what Eve got. Was philosophy from the damn devil? Esau That's eat him if you can receive uh -huh. it, you know. Uh -huh. Okay, Deuteronomy twenty-eight and verse fifty-six: the tender and delicate woman among you, the tender and delicate woman among you, which will not venture to set the sole of her foot upon the ground for delicateness and tenderness. Her eyes shall be evil toward her husband. See that? 
right. and, and, and of her bosom and towards her son and towards her daughter. You mm -hmm. see that? Killing them, man. Before they even get a chance to, uh, you know, bloom and grow. Sloppy, That's right. All right. And toward, uh, toward her young, young one that cometh out from between her feet. You see that? Planned Parenthood. I never understood why they even called it. Well, Planned Parenthood. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. All right. And toward her children, which she shall bear, for she shall eat them for want of all, uh, all things, secretly in the siege and straightness wherewith thine enemies shall distress thee in thy gates, man. Okay, we all know what that's going into. That's right. All right. Exodus 20 and verse 12. If I may, <laughs> mm -hmm. right. honor thy father and thy mother, that thy days may be long upon the land which the Lord Yahweh, thy, uh, 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 thy power, giveth thee, man. Okay, so you know, hey, getting rid, getting rid of or, or killing, that's it's murder. Let's call it what it is. That's it. It's hey, murder. What, hey, what's the name of the song though? <clears throat> Say what now? What's the name of the song? Oh, murder I got on my mind, right? I got murder on my mind, right? Mm -hmm. That's right, Doc. That's right. Absolutely, you know. And uh, and uh, you know, a hey, the uh, the prosperity of the wicked. They have taken crafty counsel, but see, our people, our uh, our people's hearts are far from you. How about Shimmy Yawashai? They're far from him. They have Absolutely. they have no fear, and what they're doing is chasing. Uh, 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 what is a uh, apostle Gabar? He always says uh, these women are uh, hypergamy or hypergamist. Right, right. You right. know, chasing, chasing clout, clout chasers, man. Well, you know, at the end of the day, man, you know, when you talk about just a woman's natural nature, man, a woman need to be led, man, because if not, man, a woman based all her movements and all her life just strictly off emotion, man. Right, mm-hmm. There's nothing rational about her decision making, man. Right. It's, you know, whatever feels good. You know, that's what it's all about. Whatever makes me happy. Yep. That's why the, you know? yeah, that's why the scripture said there's an order. Absolutely. And, and your desire shall be towards your husband, man. Okay? Mm-hmm. You know? All right. Hey, I got one more uh uh, you know, no I, way, I, if you you know, if you got something, you know, bring it out. Hey, just just let me know because cause you know me, I'm long winded. Hey, go ahead, brother. That spirit jumps all over me, man. How about you, y'all shy? The spirit jumps all over me, man. All right? Hey, I understand, brother. Oh, this is Psalms 80, 83 and verse 2. For lo, thy enemies. Our people don't understand we got enemies, man. It's the same people that give you, uh, uh, it's the same people that, that produced that song, I Got Murder on My Mind. It's the same people that, uh, 1948, Small Hatters, mm -hmm. that stole your nationality and then told you to kill your own babies, man. <laughs> how about that? <laughs> yeah. How about hey? How about them apples? Right. right. You see. Mm -hmm. All right. Psalms 80, <laughs> 83 verse two. For lo, thy enemies make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted up the head. Verse three. Right. They have taken crafty counsel. How so? By putting a Planned Parenthood here and there. By telling you 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 just a Gentile by by teaching the children in the schools that uh, uh, slavery was nothing more than an indigenous servitude. But uh, hey, yeah, uh, uh, go ahead, brother. Hey, we ain't gonna talk about uh, what they're now putting in the, in the uh, schools for as the uh, effeminate oh. uh, doggone behavior they got going on in the schools. They got doggone. Uh, Drag queens coming up to the school, yep. teaching the kids, man. Yep. Hey, man, what do you think this is all about? Hey, like you said, the song, the eighty third chapter, right? So at the end of the day, all this is leading to what? Make sure Israel is no more in remembrance. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. That's hey. You know, I'm getting ready to. You already know that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Hey, verse three. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones, which are the Israelites, northern and southern kingdom. That's right. Okay. They have said, come, let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. These these ninjas forgot. Mm -hmm. And the scripture even said, you, uh, thyself shall discontinue from thine heritage, man. Okay. Right. All right. Verse five, they have consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. And you, you can move on down. And it talks about, what's the first one? 
<laughs> the Tabernacles of Edom. That's right. The so-called so white man. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Then it then it, it said Amalek. It's a whole it's a whole bunch. All these nations gonna get paid back for what they've done, man. That's it, bro. Okay. You know. And so I've got pulled up right here. Oh boy, this devil, man. A whole lot of brothers done claim this one. Uh, Margaret Sanger. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Margaret Sanger, and look what's right below that. Ain't that something? In the news, in, in the news, right? right. <laughs> in the news, look uh, uh, below that is uh, uh, that ninja you were just talking about. What's the name? Oh, oh man. Uh, uh, Candace Owens? Nah, 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 man. The rapper, man. I forget what his name is. Kanye West. Oh, oh yeah, Kanye, yeah, yeah. Right mm -hmm. up under that. Ain't that something? Mm -hmm. Okay. It was like they said in. uh. Uh, what was that? <laughs> Saturday Night Live. Ain't that special? You know what I'm saying? Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Margaret Sanger. This was an American devil. That's right. Right here what it says is uh, American birth control act birth control activist. Really, she just a damn Edomite that wants to that wanted to exterminate Israelites. That's it. All right. Educator and nurse at that. Mm -hmm. You know, September 14, 1879. Let's see. I wanted to go into um, the first president and the founder of Planned Parenthood. Yeah, Margaret Sanger, 1922. The first president and founder of Planned Parenthood. The uh, uh, origins of Planned Parenthood date. Uh, I don't. I don't give a damn when it started. I want to see what some of these quotes you said. Okay. So well, I can tell you one off the top of my head, man. Of what she said, man. Margaret Sanger said, um, "Negroes should not." Mm. Be able to reproduce. That's a quote. She did say that. Yeah, that's a quote. <laughs> yeah, that, that sure is. That is one of her quotes. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There we go. Hey, I, I got something pulled up right here. Look at that oh, damn God. devil, man. She looked like a regular old devil. She like one of my neighbors. Okay. Well, you we well, you know um, <laughs> she's related to Bill Gates, right? Ah, that's that's correct. That's right. Mm -hmm. She sure is, ain't she? Mm hmm. That's right. I don't, I'm not sure what the relationship is, but she is. Yeah, man. I think um, wow. that's his aunt or great aunt, something like that. Yeah, they, I mean, they they close in relation. Yeah, they look alike. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then again, all Edomites look alike. All right. <laughs> nah, man, I can't say that. Okay, let's go. Let's move on down here and see. Uh, it's sign a petition to defund Planned Parenthood forever. Yahweh Ba Shimei Yahweh Shai going to defund everything. Okay. Right. All right. Uh, let's see. One. But for my views, I believe that there should be no more babies. 1947. Okay. Two. The most merciful thing that the lar that the large family does to one does to one is of its infant members is to kill it. This devil said that. Mm -hmm. You see. Three. We don't want uh, the word to go out that we want to exterminate the Negro population. Mm -hmm. And a, hey, what was I saying before in the beginning of this? And hopefully this is edifying. I don't, you know, I don't want to speak too much. But what was I saying in the beginning? All those Planned Parenthood commercials that this devil started was about who? So-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans. I'm going to tell you something else, too, man, that correlates with that, right? Mm -hmm. When you see commercials on TV and it's talking about HIV prevention, yep. the tribes are always featured right. in those commercials, man. Right. Mm -hmm. That's right, bro. Absolutely. You ain't lying, okay? Man, get a... Oh man, what's that scripture I was thinking of? Hey, don't worry, I got. I, got I, I know you, I, man. Thanks. I got two. I'm about to come with right now, hey. bro. Don't even worry about it. Call hello, you high about shim y'all shy. All right, I'm gonna read this. I'm gonna read this last one right here. Just this last little, last little piece, and I'm gonna quit running my damn mouth. Okay. Oh, go ahead, brother. I right, check this out now. L listen to this right here. I accepted mm. an invitation to talk with the woman's branch of the Ku Klux Klan. Absolutely, yep. And, and and this is the Planned Parenthood that's in every damn uh, uh, inner city, in every so-called black, Latino, and Native American neighborhood. It's all over the place. And again, it's nothing more than murder. I was that's escorted it. by the platform, was introduced, and began to speak in the end. Um, <clears throat> so like you, in the end, 
those uh, simple illustrations, I believe that I have accomplished my purpose. You see that? A dozen invitations to speak to similar groups were uh, were preferred. Okay, so and so go ahead, bro. I mean, that's so much. I don't even read no more of this. It's it, uh, uh, this damn devil. I don't hey, want to read no more of this. Go ahead. Absolutely. Uh. This is uh, Sirach, uh chapter 26, verse 9 to 12. The whoredom of a woman may be known in a haughty looks and eyelids. Stop mm -hmm. right there. Mm -hmm. You got E today with these doggone caterpillars on their eyes, right? <laughs> That's fucking whoredom. Right. Caterpillars, man. Yep. Feather dusters. That's yep. whoredom. That's right, bro. Verse 10. If thy daughter be shameless, keep her in straightly. Least she abuse herself through overmuch liberty. This is why the connection, well, the union between Eve and Esau. Eve loves Esau because Esau gave her liberty. Yep. Verse 11. Yep. Watch over an impudent eye. And marvel not if she trespass against thee. She will open her mouth as a thirsty traveler when he have found a fountain and drank of every water near her, every hedge will she sit down and open her quiver mm. against every arrow. There you have it, man. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'm coming right behind that, too. Yeah, come this with. Is, uh, Let's go. I'm going to stay in Sirach, the 26th chapter. I'm just going to jump down to verse 25. A shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that is shame faced will fear the Lord, man. That's right. You yeah. know? And we all know what a damn female dog is, right? Hey, man, all day long, brother. Now, be at You ain't even got to say right. it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, mm -hmm. and, and, and when you when you was reading that man, see that's what that's the thing, that's the thing, man. If our people, which they won't, because Yahweh Hashem Yahusha, he already he already said he uh, when he, when he wrote it when he wrote it down when he spoke it, that's that, you know. But uh, but when he said two thirds of our people won't listen, if they were rooted in and rooted in these scriptures, they would understand and they would see. They would see that you should never join hand with your enemy. That's right. That's yeah, and, right. And, when, and when's the last time Esau, Edom, or any of these heathen nations had our uh, best, uh, 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 what do you call it, uh, uh, had us in their mind where they could uh, try to help us? They ain't never tried to help us. Hell no, they you know? Yeah, read Obadiah. You know, absolutely, brother. You know? Absolutely, man. Read Obadiah, man. All right? So I, I, got, I got this right here. I got to read this. This is okay. Sirach 12 and verse 10. Never. Trust thine enemy, for like iron rusted, so is his wickedness. That's right. You know, though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him and her and the child. And thou, right. you know, <laughs> ain't that right, though? That's right. You know, hey, you remember that little girl talking about uh, 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 when the mom was like, who ate the cookie? She said it was a black man. Hey, brother, that's already, that's already uh, in the spirit, man. Yeah, you see that? Verse 11. Spirit. That's right, Ock. That's right. Though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him. And thou shall be unto him as if thou hast wiped a looking glass. And thou shall know that his rust have not altogether been wiped away. You know? That's Because he, he's going to be wicked. He, he, that's the, he's a, a, a vessel of wrath fitted to destruction. All right? Verse 12. Set him not by thee. You see? And that's what, that's what Eve has done. She's put him. Mm -hmm. She's put him over her. Okay. Mm -hmm. Set him not by thee, lest when he overthrow thee, he stand up in thy place. Neither let him sit at thy right hand, lest he seek to take thy seat. That's right. And thou at the last, well, and we we right here at the last, ain't we? That's right. And brother. thou at the last, remember my words and be pricked therewith. Mm -hmm. Verse thirteen. Who will pity a charmer? That is bitten with a serpent, -hoo -hoo. or any such as come nigh wild beast, man. Mm -hmm. and, and that's heavy. That's that could be twofold to Eve. Hey man, she gonna experience all that in Jacob's trouble, you know? Yeah, that's right, huh? That's right. That's right. Absolutely. Let's jump on down to verse sixteen. Uh, Sheeta is my enemy, right? 
You know, Micah 7 verse 10. Anyway, verse 16, an enemy speaks sweetly with his lips. But in his heart, he imagined how to throw thee into a pit. That's what Gloria Astonum was doing. I just had that pulled up, by the way. You know, mm -hmm. she she's sitting there talking about uh, power to the people. They got their fist up like they doing something. You know, all that that women's liberation, all that gets mixed up into one thing. Uh, 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 the queen of heaven spirit. It's all written in the Bible. Our people, our people, they don't consider, man. That's the that's why the first script. That's the first scripture I read was Isaiah one of verse two, uh, verse three. You see that? That's right. brother. All right. That's right. Yeah. Verse 16. An enemy speaks sweetly with his lips, but in his heart, he imagined how to throw thee into a pit. He will weep with he will weep with his eyes. But if he find opportunity, he will not be satisfied with blood. Absolutely, brother. You know, you know, uh, absolutely. You know, in verse 17, if adversity come upon thee, thou shalt find him there first. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? These scriptures are very un infallible, man. Mm -hmm. If adversity come upon thee, thou shalt find him there first. And though he uh, pretend to help thee, yet he he will undermine thee. He would shake his head, he would clap his hands and whisper much and change his countenance. Woo. And you see that every day, man, just by um, interactions going out with Esau, man, you know, throughout your travels throughout the day, you know? Absolutely, bro. Absolutely. You know, as soon as you walk in the room, Esau's countenance changed, man. Yes, yep, he sure does. Mm-hmm. And he sure does, man. He changes like the damn wind. He's the damn devil the Bible speaks of. Uh, Ecclesiastes 7 and verse 26, I find more bitter than death the woman whose heart's is snared. See, she got trapped up. Mm -hmm. You know, that serpent in the garden, which was a man, was teaching her philosophies. That's right. And That's she, right. Got, she got snared and trapped up by the damn spirit of the damn devil. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and again, that parlayed on to uh, 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 Abel, uh, uh, Salakia, Cain, and then to Esau, all right? That's right. Snares and nets and her bands as the bands, whoso pleaseth the most, as bands, so like you, whoso pleaseth the most, I shall escape from her, but the sinners shall be taken by her. That's right. These scriptures are heavy, man. Hey, I'm coming right behind you. I, Come on with it. This is uh, Proverbs chapter 8, verse 13. Let's go. The fear of the Lord is to hate evil, mm. pride and arrogance. That's Esau. Mm -mm, mm. And the evil way and the forward mouth do I hate. And this is, uh, I'm going to stay in Proverbs. This is Proverbs chapter 9 and verse 13. Mm. A foolish woman is clamorous. She is simple and knoweth nothing. Ooh. Hey, and that video sums it up, then. That's right. It sure does. That video sums it up, man. It sure does. And you know what, man? You got to be out your damn mind, man, to want to uh, get with a Eve like that and lay down with her and procreate something, man. You got to be out your damn mind, bro. Hey, man, even the scriptures say that. Man, but, man, you got to be out your mind, man. I mean, didn't, uh, uh, was it Paul? He, uh, uh, Absolutely. Yeah, that's Absolutely. right. Yeah, he said, man, he said, don't even deal with him, man. Absolutely, it's not good for you to touch a woman. That's what he said. That's yep. right. You don't don't even deal with him. You know it's better. Hey, look, uh, we followed the example of Yahweh Shai. He didn't deal with him. That's right. Why That's didn't right. he deal with him? Because man, because he hey, he death is swallowed up in victory. He already knew. You know mm -hmm. he he's going he's mm -hmm. going to get his. And see, you know? made uh, you know the Lord perfect as well, man. You know that's right. Uh, to get a little deeper, you dig what I'm saying? You know. When he was uh, when he was Solomon, he had already seen what it was all about. Right. You know. Right. He knew what it you was. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You know. Hey, that's that, that's precisely why he said, "I came to die for my sins first. Right. You see, and right. these scriptures are written in parables. See, that's what a lot of people don't understand. Is the election has obtained it, and the rest were blind. I'm not saying we are part of the elect. We we creatures of hope. But, you know, but when it comes down to it, and when he said, I died for my sins first, now, he did he sin when he was Yahweh Shai? Absolutely not. He so <laughs> didn't. And that's reincarnation. If you if you can receive it, you can receive it. Hey, when he was Solomon, right? Right. He said Solomon should get uh, get uh, beaten with the uh, with the rod of man, right? Right. 
That didn't happen to Solomon. That happened to you, Howard Shaw. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, see that? See That's that? Reincarnation. Yep. Until you New Testament uh, or Old Testament for that. What did it say? It said, uh, they pierced my hands and my feet, man. Mm -hmm. Okay? So you can get over all that, too. All right? Hey, Proverbs 15 and verse 4. A wholesome tongue is a tree of life, but perverseness therein is a breach in the spirit. You see that? Absolutely, brother. And, and, and again, and going back to that song, even the Planned Parenthood, and uh, even though those commercials were disgusting also. Oh, uh, man, absolutely. Absolutely disgusting. You know, uh, and again, that was a whole nigga, man. That was, a, uh, you know, that was, that was Uncle, Uncle, Uncle Phil. Mm -hmm. You know? All right? A breach of spirit. Let me read that one more time. Proverbs 15, verse 4. A wholesome tongue, which is speech, right? Is a tree of life, but perverseness therein is a breach in the spirit. A foolish uh, despiseth his father's instruction, but he that regardeth reproof is prudent, man. That's right. Hey, man, these scriptures are heavy. Oh, boy, I got to keep on. Let's go on down here. In the house of the righteous is much treasure, but in the uh, uh, in the revenues of the wicked is trouble. Verse seven, the lips of the wise despi uh, dis disperse knowledge. They do what? The lips of the wise disperse knowledge and knowledge mm -hmm. and wisdom shall be, uh, st shall be the stability of our times. Right. That's right. Brother. But the heart of the foolish doeth not so, man. Mm -hmm. mm, mm, mm. That's heavy, bro. That's heavy. Very heavy, brother. This is uh, Job chapter 14, verse 1 and 2. Man that is born of a woman is a few days mm. and full of trouble. Mm. He cometh forth like a flower and is cut down. He fleeth also as a shadow and continueth not. Hey, man. You know. Um, wow. All of this, man, at the end of the day, man, it came for us disobeying your shop, man. That's you right. know, now we got to deal with, you know, this raggedy Eve talking about she got murder on the mind. You dig what I'm saying? At the Planned Parenthood, man. Yeah. You, you know, because yeah. we cheated on your shop. So your shop, I mean, we cheated on, we cheated on your but she your shop. So, hey, man, what did he do? In return, he made our women what? Do the whores, yep. man. Do the same. Yep. Yeah, that's man. right, brother. Yeah, he said your wife should be a harlot in the streets. That's right. That's right, man. Yeah, he, he did the same thing. And see, hey, see now what? Now what? Mm -hmm. Yahweh about Shem Yahshua? Now what? He wants his virgins, man. That's right. Brother. You know, he wants he wants us uh, purified and cleaned up through the fire. That's right. And that's, that's exactly right, what he's doing. That's what that's what he's doing to us. Look at the gift he's given us. That's it, brother. Call her Lord Yahweh about Shem Yahshua, man. Man, all praise the Yahweh about Shem Yahshua, man. Look at what he's done for us, man. You know, that's, that's right. He's, he's giving us the greatest gift. He's cleaning us up. Mm -hmm. He's uh, bringing us back to a pure language, a pure mind, uh, uh, being uh, washed by the by the uh, the word by the water, uh, the water by the word, man. That's right. It's beautiful. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now I got one more here, and if you got anything else, hey, let's go. Isaiah fifty nine okay. and verse three. Yeah, he's cleaned us up, man. He's getting us. He's getting us ready for that for that uh, 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 ceremony, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and that ceremony is going to get hot. Isaiah, hot. yeah, it's going to get hot up in here. Like, like, you know, like they said in the Midwest. <laughs> <laughs> Isaiah, <laughs> sluggy, y'all. Sometimes, sometimes I got a joke, man. Keep from crying. Damn. Isaiah 59, verse 3. For your hands are defiled with blood and your fingers with iniquity. Your lips have spoken lies. Your tongue have muttered perverseness. OK, none that calleth for justice, nor any pleadeth for truth. They trust in vanity and speak lies. They conceive mischief and bring forth iniquity. OK, let's read this right here. Verse five. I love these scriptures, man. This is beautiful. Absolutely. Bro. Thy hatch cockatrice eggs. And what's a cockatrice do? Do you know that? The, you know, hey, that's a snake, right? Uh, no, uh, cock, uh, cockatrice. Yeah, yeah, cockatrice. Mm -hmm. What does what what, what a cockatrice do? Slither around? Yeah, 
Around, okay, yeah. they hatch yeah. cockatrice eggs and weave the spider's web. Hey, there you go, bro. He that eateth of their eggs dieth, mm-hmm. and that and that which is crushed breaketh out into a viper. There you go. This is, I mean, this is heavy, man. Mm-hmm. Their webs shall not become garments, neither shall their she, Salakia, neither shall they cover themselves with their works. Their works are works of iniquity, and the act of violence is in their hands. Mm -hmm. Their feet run to evil, and they make haste to shed innocent blood. Their thoughts are thoughts of iniquity, uh, uh, wasting Salakia, and destruction are in their past. Serious, brother. Super serious, man. Serious, man. See, that's why you can't play with you cannot play. You can't put your how about Shimi Yasha in a box. He's coming cruel, and people's people's faces are gonna be as flames, and that's that. That's that, brother. Okay. Hey, this is uh hmm, this is uh Hosea chapter four, verse fourteen. Um, I will not punish your daughters when they commit whoredom nor your spouses when they commit adultery. For themselves are separate with whores, and they sacrifice with harlots. Therefore, mm. the people that do not understand shall fall. Ooh. I'm going to read 15 to 16 too, man. That's beautiful. Though thou, Israel, play the harlot, yet let not Judah offend and come unto Gilead, Neither go ye up until Beethoven, nor sweat the Lord, the Lord liveth. For Israel slided back as a backslided heifer. Now the Lord will feed them as a, as a lamb in a large place. Mm. But hey, come to find out, Judah, Judah did the same thing. Though. Right, right. That's right. <laughs> you know? Judah did the same thing, man. That's right, brother. That's right. You know? So this is why we got, us, us brothers, we got to get it right first, man. So we can have, you know, uh, virtuous women, you know? Yeah, yeah. Women. That's right. You got to get your house in order, man. That's it, man. You have to get your house in order, man. Examine thyself first. Examine yourself. Humble down. That's it, brother. Examine yourself, man. Mm-hmm. You know? Because, again, you know, I say this almost in every lesson. Our righteousness is as filthy rags, man. That's it. You know, our righteousness is as filthy rags, and we have got to humble down and come back to the true power and spirit of Yahweh Shai. Okay. Man, the elect gonna do us. The true, the true uh, husbandry of the universe, man. That's right, brother. You see, mm-hmm. that's our that's our power right there. So that's it, man. You know, hey, you got anything to close out on? Yeah, I got one more to close out to go along with that Hosea, man. That's it's beautiful. It's going to tie right into it, man. Fine. And uh, basically, tie into what you were just speaking right there, uh, you know, uh, us coming back to the Lord, man, and uh, humility come first, man, because uh, we can't forget about why we in this position, man. You know? You know, one thing about uh, one thing about Jake, man, Jake be having memory lapses, man. Sure. You know? This is uh this is Isaiah uh I'll scrap that, scrap that. Scrap that. Mm. Scrap that, I got a new. One. I got a new one. I'm coming with. Hey, well that's the spirit, man. Hey, let it roll with this, you. Hey, this is Job thirty nine and seventeen. Let's go with that. Mm. Let's go with that. Yeah, I like that better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like that better. Oh, man. Joe 39 to 17, man. This is for you beta males following behind Eve, man. <laughs> you know, because you got a lot of beta males out here following behind the woman, man. Yep. Man, you follow behind a woman, man. Death shall become you, man. Right. This is uh, Joe 39 uh 17. That's right. Because Yahweh have deprived her of wisdom, neither have he imparted her understanding. Right. No understanding. Zero understanding. 
So, hey, man, this is why you got songs like that, man. Murder on my mind, man. Yep. That's you right. Know? That's right, bro. And so, like it for the coughing in the background, man. My, my wife's having some uh, issues. Oh, it's, oh, it's all good, yeah. brother. It's all good. But, man. hey, man. All right. So, hey, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and close out there. Hey, this has been a good lesson, Ock. And through water for, uh, you know, filtering my phone call, man. Oh, man. Always, brother. You know? So, oh, boy. Uh, it's unbelievable, these things that are happening. You know, hey, that's why we stay occupied. Worse, man. Yeah, well, that's why we stay occupied in prophecies, man. I mean, because you know, we could have went into uh, all kinds of different things, man. But uh, you know, I had this, I had this lesson set back for just a little while, and I just wanted to go into it just to show, you know, not to say look at these evil women and nothing. Nah, man, it's just all. It's this is all to teach the elect. It's all about the elect, and it's truth. Yeah, man. All right, these uh, everything has to be spoken. Okay. Everything, man. So with that, giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh. Bahashem. Yahweh Shai. Bahashem. Rakakwadash. Again, hey, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, of whom I learn from daily. You know? That's right, brother. You know, and a healthy shalom to the brothers that are doing the work in truth and sincerity, not faking it, not for filthy lucre, not for anything else, but for Yahweh Shim Yahweh Shai. That's it, brother. Okay? We're trying to get that penny, man. We're trying to get that penny. Yeah, man, I'm trying to get that penny. I want to be gathered up in the barn, and I'd love to see uh, the, the likes of you brothers, you know, hey, sitting back with the crown up on your head watching this place get devoured by fire. That's right, brother. You know? You know? And like I say all the time, hey, man, DTA and Kwam Yashawala, why a Bible ball? Boom! Boom! <laughs> <laughs> yes! Boom! <laughs> With a great noise, and the heavens roll together as a scroll. <laughs> that's, that's right, I. Woo! Boom! All right, all right, Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.